Hi everybody, I just wanted to do a quick video about how as a PC gamer, if you want to play with your DAISY buddies on console DAISY, how you can do that with Xbox uh, Game Pass Ultimate. So if you join Xbox Game Pass Ultimate, and you try it out for it's normally like a pound or a buck or a dollar for the first month, and then it's about £11 a month after that. If you join Xbox Game Pass Ultimate, for you know, which there isn't a different PC and console one, there's just Gus Xbox Game Pass Ultimate because it works on PC and console. If you, if you join that and then you download the Xbox app, you've got um, options of the um, different things you can do. So you get a load of PC games that you can download and play locally on your PC, and, and I mean a lot. You know, there's there's an there's an awful lot there that you can, that you can download and play directly. Um, but also you get cloud gaming, and this is where the the Daisy bit comes in. So cloud gaming is where you're not actually going to download and play the um, game on your PC. You're going to stream it from Microsoft and this works very very well and the games you stream aren't PC games they're console games so when you play DayZ on your PC using the streaming part of Xbox Game Pass Ultimate you're playing the console version so it means you can then play and chat with your your, your console builders. now this isn't true crossplay in the fact that you're not playing you know on um, you, you can't play on PC servers as a console player, but this shows you how as a PC player you can play on console Daisy and console servers really easily as well. And if you're watching this and thinking, well, I've got a console, what's this got to do with me? Actually, if you're running something like um, uh, an X original Xbox One or an Xbox One S, playing Daisy through the cloud is actually a really good way of playing it because you actually normally get 60 frames a second at 1080p you know it runs better through this than it does um on something like an xbox one one s and in fact i'd say if you've got an xbox one or a one s don't install Daisy to the console play it via the cloud option and all you do is you just click on it um and then it will say play you've got to make sure you've got a controller uh, plugged in and it will contact the servers in the cloud um, you'll need to chat to your Xbox buddies and find out what servers they're on, you know, whether they're on vanilla servers or, or community servers, all that sort of stuff. Um, and, and you can get in, you can chat with them, you can play with them, and you are playing console day Z on your PC. Um, and this also works very, very well if you've got an old laptop as well. So, for example, I'm doing this on a really seven year old laptop, a seven year old Acer laptop that couldn't play games when it was new. And yet, here I am. This might not record very well, actually, my screen capture software. Here we go, play, so I can get onto my Xbox server, um, and we'll load in, and uh, we're on a PC playing console DayZ, and we could chat with our Xbox friends and do all that sort of stuff. Let's just load in, and then, then I'll quit out, just to kind of show you. Good old DayZ. Dum -dum. gone from strength to strength this year hasn't it well I'm recording this video in the end of uh, now this probably won't look very good on the screen recording software because my screen recording software doesn't work very well but there we go that is um, that is console daisy playing on a PC okay so hopefully you found that useful um, if you have uh, hit the like button if you want to see more of the same press subscribe and I will of course see you again soon